Hey, it's Jesse Quest. I'm playing Mega Man 3 because I know someone asked for it some time ago. One person. And I need to play Mega Man right now because I feel bad. So, I am going to play Mega Man because it always recenters me. I've always played Mega Man in my past to make myself feel better. So, that's what's happening. No guarantees of anything else tonight. Just Mega Man till the cows come home, as the title says. Hey, son, how's it going? Good to see you. Damn it. Fucking vacuum cleaner bastards. They look like fucking vacuum cleaners, don't they? Um, I have clinical anxiety and depression, so it kicks in every once in a while. So, yes and no. Um, I'm just doing what makes me feel more centered, which is playing a game that I've always loved. And ever since the 90s, I was a 90s kid, you know? I, I mean, I was born 87, but, uh... I always had Mega Man, and I know someone asked for Mega Man 3 at some point, so I'm doing Mega Man 3, just to uh, feel better, you know? But not really, I'm not, I'm not great right now. I may play Stardew Valley later, but nothing is guaranteed, you know? Thanks for coming by and saying hi, son. Hope you're having an awesome evening. Damn it. Fucking med. Can't guarantee I'm gonna be super entertaining. It's alright. It is what it is, you know. Life hits hard. These things just take time. All you can do sometimes is just wait it out. And that is... It is what it is. Thanks. It won't be like Mega Man Maker, where it's boring as shit. I'm actually progressing through a game this time, so... At least it should be interesting, a little bit more interesting this time for you than watching me look at stuff on Mega Man Maker instead of actually playing. Damn it. Here we go. Top platforms. Spinning me around and shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. I feel like it's glitching. Weird. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I made it through. Alright, Top Man. It's time for Top Man to get wrecked. Thank you for being here, son. It does mean something to me for anyone being here. I'm not always super bubbly and I don't know. Part of it is putting on a show because I'd like to entertain, but. You know, I try and have fun in all my life, but clinical anxiety and depression are a real, a very real thing, so it's rough. You got Top Spin. And we're gonna take Top Spin to Shadow Man's level. Scotto, that was great Rosh Hashanah dinner. Happy Rosh Hashanah to you. How are you doing, Riscato? I am not feeling good. I am depressed, so I am playing what centers me. Also, I believe someone asked for Mega Man 3 at some point, so thought I would just do it. Oh, 
I'm not pushing myself when, when playing this. I may not read the chat as much as I usually do, you know, and I may not be as vocal as I usually am, but, uh, I'm always up for streaming. It doesn't matter what state I'm in, I can stream. Uh, you know, I just want to be there. I want to give something more than anything, and who knows, maybe halfway through the game I'll feel better and start being a little bit more entertaining, you know? You all put smiles on my face, so... Who knows? Who knows what could happen? I could be entertaining you in a few minutes here when I get warmed up. Doesn't mean I'm necessarily not depressed, but I, <laughs> you know. Um, uh, specifically, you said, but if you are not 100%, do not push it. Many of us will support you regardless. Thank you. That means a lot to me. Sun says I don't mind. I, I mean. This is what I've done whenever I've been sad in the past, is when I've ever had access to it, is play Mega Man, and even when I'm not sad, I just, I love this game, I live and breathe this game, I'm not gonna say I'm the best in the world at it, I just love it, it's, that it just is what it is. Love ain't always perfect. What the fuck is going on with my pad? You know what it is? Okay, no, it's not that. Weird. It's like it's, the, the, the pad is not working the way it should. Like, I, I was holding right. Oh, cool, I just quit the game. That's perfect. That is just a sum up of my fucking, you know, experiences. Time to go through Top Man's level again. Good thing it didn't happen. I, I, I was just being oblivious and just pressing whatever I could to try and get out of the menu. Okay. Muscat says, shouldn't the lava in this stage be warm? That's not lava. I never thought that was lava. I always thought that was sewage. You're in Shadow Man's level. Shadow Man's level doesn't have lava. He's like in a sewer. That's why he's Shadow Man. He's underground. So, yeah. It's gross. That's what I always thought. And the music is always... The music for him is like really cool and I don't know. Secret agenty sounding. Not this one. So I always thought he was like in an underground layer in like the sewer. That's what I always thought. At least. Alright, let's beat this bastard again. Why not, right? I don't know, this controller I need to actually like Oh, when I hold this too hard. Okay, I'm using the stick, because the D-pad is really fucking weird. I don't even like using the stick for Mega Man, the analog stick. I, you know, grew up with the D-pad on the NES, but I'm just gonna have to use it, because it keeps fucking up. Like, it's just weird. Like, I thought I was stuck on the top, the tops earlier, and it was probably because of my fucking controller. Alright. The music is catchy as hell. Although this may be the hardest Mega Man for me. A Mega Man, I mean, I don't know, that or like... I mean, Mega Man base if you catch... if you... Uh, count them as if you count that game. Yeah, the, the analog stick is doing me wonders now. I feel like I'm actually in control. Damn. Hey, Rai. I'm not doing any Mega Man Maker. Sorry. I'm kind of super depressed right now. So I'm just kind of trying to re center myself. Uh, someone wanted to see Mega Man 3, I know that much, so I thought I'd do Mega Man 3 at the very least. Alright, Top Man, round 2, let's go. You're gonna lose again. Bring it. Got him. 
a second time. Glad to hear, though, Riscato, that you're having a good Rosh Hashanah. Thanks for coming by and saying hi, regardless. Uh, that, that means a lot to me. Alright. You got topspin. Again. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Back on the NES, you didn't have a save feature. It was, if, if it went out for any reason, like the dog ran by and it like shook the Nintendo enough to glitch it out, you were fucked. That was it. Game over. You're done. Like, time to restart the game. Unless you had a save feature. There's a password feature, okay? But if you're a little kid, sometimes you don't even give a shit about writing the password down. I did sometimes, but probably only between, probably only when I got to like Wily's castle or something. Dun, 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 dun. See, this looks more like water to me. That's not lava. I don't think so. It's like dark. It's like river of like sewage or oil or something. It's, I don't think it's oil either. It's just flowing pretty good. I always thought this was like in a uh, like a freaking sewer or something. Jer, holy crap, it's good to see you. It's good to see all my people who come in regulars when I'm not feeling good. Uh, Jer says, hi Jesse. I hope playing this game can help start the process of lifting your spirits again. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, man. That really means a lot to me. I, I really appreciate it. It's always nice to see people come in and just, I don't know, I, it's, it's hard, but everyone has this fight, I think, at some point or another. Whether they have clinical anxiety or, and depression or just are straight up sad, everyone goes through this. It's a human thing. I thank you for coming in and being a good person. That, that means a lot to me. More than any subscriber count, to be to be completely honest. <sighs> All right, let's let now let's kill Shadow Man. Let's let's wipe the grin the grin off of his shadowy face, his sewer dwelling fucking face. Sun says, spread the spread the positivity. I may not have anxiety and severe depression. I do endure of severe medical. That's rough. Medical problems can like make that stuff show up eventually, you know. So I I feel for you. Um, I don't have. I mean, I don't really have any huge medical conditions. I have like eczema, and I, I grew up with eczema as a kid, and that made my nights like horrible. And kids thinking I had like a rash. Whenever I was there, I like kind of looked like a freak to them or whatever. I'd be like, no, it's not contagious. It's, it's my freaking eczema or whatever. Kids can be cruel, <laughs> but they weren't cruel either because, you know, they want to be safe, you know, innocently enough. But uh, that kind of stuff sticks with you too. You can eat. Uh, you help me escape reality. I hope I do. Reality is a tough place to be, and, you know, I'm not telling anyone to ignore it. I have my own, you know, even though I say not to talk about politics and sex, race, religion, whatever, um, like, super deep neg and even negative stuff, it's not like I don't have opinions on that. It's just I know that professionally, if I want to make someone happy, I I I'm trying to take someone out of that. Unless you're, like, on a stream that's, like, you know that's, like, a theme of the stream, then you don't really want to hear about that, you know? Um, this is all about fun. This is all about escape, escaping and resting for a little while. I hope I can help you all do that, so. Rai says, have a great afternoon. Bye. Thank you so much for coming. Mixels says, hi, Jess and Mega Man. Yes, indeed. 
I love this game. Mega Man 3 is, is crazy. It's actually pretty damn rough turning up the music because I love the music. Especially this theme. It's very industrious sounding for an electric like power plant or whatever it's supposed to be. It's super sci-fi looking. Shadow Man is not even a shadow. Nope. Even the, this music just gets my blood pumping. Even if I'm sad, it's like... Just, I don't know, it's hard not to freaking love it. Um... Let's see here. Also, Taco Conch appears on the scene and says, Did you ever play Duke Nukem back in the day, Jesse Quest? I was surprised they had direct port to PSN right now. I did not know. Um, but, you know what? I was more of a Doom guy. I played Doom when I was a kid. Not a guy. I was more of a Doom child. I don't know if I should have even been subjected to that, but I was, and I loved it um, for what it was as just being a fast action, fast action-packed game shooting demons, um, but yeah, um, I didn't act, I've never act, I've heard a lot about Duke Nukem, I know all the phrases and stuff, I never, I've never played it though, I've never played it, not that I don't want to or anything, that's not the case. Better than old school Doom, if you ask me. We'll see about that, I guess. I don't know. I'll probably play it eventually. I mean, they're kind of different beasts. Like, he's fighting aliens and it's humorous. Doom is, like, bloody as fuck. And just... You're just destroying everything. It's grim and everything is cruel about it. You're cruel in the way you fu fight them. They're cruel in the way they fight you. It's just dark as fuck. I feel like they're completely different beasts, if you ask me. I don't know if they could be graded on the same sort of scale, but that's just what I think. Oh, man. Feels good play a game that I love. It just does. Dylan L. Fantas Fantana says, Hello, men. Hello, Dylan. Uh, it's good to see you. Thank you for coming. I don't know if I've seen you in here before. If you're here, uh, you're new. Welcome to the channel. I am kind of going through a depression phase right now, though, so I'm not gonna be incredibly entertaining. I'm just playing Mega Man 3, because I remember someone saying they wanted it played, and Mega Man is also what I play to center myself more, so... It just makes me feel better. I don't know. It makes me feel happy. Reminds me of those nights sitting beside the Nintendo Entertainment System, jumping into chasms like a moron. No, um, <laughs> trying so hard to find out, like, the weaknesses of the bosses and the order, and playing the games over and over again. It's more along the lines of probably what I was going to say, but... Jared says the original Mega Man game is harder than Mega Man 3. Uh, I don't know about that. That's all opinion, because I've, I've, uh, I've mastered that, that shit. I can do that, like, in less than an hour. Way less than an hour. Like, 40, 40 minutes, 42 minutes, something like that. I've played it over and over and over again. The only thing that's hard about Mega Man 1 is that its mechanics are really funky, and they hadn't really ironed that out yet, to me. I don't know. Someone can say something is hard or whatever, but you don't really know unless you look at all your cold plays back to back. I mean, like, 
We've been playing these games for years now. But, again, it's just my opinion. Taco says, ask your dad if you can name the house the Mega Manor. No. <laughs> I don't. Why? Because I don't feel like it right now. Oh my god, thank goodness. I got some freaking. Some freaking life. Here we go. The magnet. Pulling me, trying to pull me off of the. Pull me into the chasm. Like most games, though, you just don't want to fall into the spikes. And if you're smart about it, you won't. But again, that's just my opinion, and I... I mean, I haven't always been good at Mega Man 1, but, I mean, like, it's just... If you're playing it enough, it's an easy game, in my opinion. But that's like everything. Practice makes perfect, right? So... Whatever. I'm not gonna talk about the difficulty of games right now, it's just... It's all opinionated. No reason to. Honestly. Zero reason to. Got it. Holy crap. That was close. Magnet man. Uh, yeah, I think I remember. Since I was a kid, just screw it, outrun him. There we go. Works too. Damn monkeys, get the fuck down from there, man. Stop monkeying around. There we go, Shadow Blade for the win. Oh my gosh. Get fucked.
fuck these things, seriously. <laughs> Go to hell. If I pause, we can hear the whole, the whole beginning of the song. There we go. Hi, Dino. First time we're not gonna fight him with White's Week 2 because I have low health, and that is a surefire way to make it so you have to play through the whole level again. Love that sound effect. Dino, I'm I'm depressed. You may want to read what what the Discord says before you continue talking here, cause not not doing good. But I decided to stream anyway and stream Mega Man, cause I know that Mega Man Three, because I know that someone wanted to see Mega Man Three at some point, so I thought why not. And Mega Man is a game that centers me naturally, so might as well, right? Free life. Please, no spoilers about Mega Man 11, if anyone is tempted to, because I'm waiting to play it when it comes out in the stores, just like I would have when I was a boy, so. If you can keep yourself from doing it. Right now, I'm kind of avoiding the chat, because I saw mention of Mega Man 11. I know that it's hype, but right now, I just, I really want to keep that... I'm hoping you all can keep that stuff on the DL for me so that I can experience it in wonder for the first time when it actually arrives instead of a billion days before it arrives. Alright. Sometimes, when you have a clinical anxiety and depression, nothing has to be wrong to be sad or depressed. It just is what it is. I'm sorry, I wish I could explain more, but there's nothing really. I can say that doing this has made me feel better, but only when talking with you all about fun stuff. I don't want any spoilers or anything to make me feel worse. It's nice to know people are actually still there for you, though, you know? In your downtime. So thank you all for coming. That means a lot to me, it really does. Alright, let's get over this hole. This is where Snake Man's level randomly turns into an air level for five seconds before the end. Pretty interesting, actually. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I jump before those come out because they are notorious to notoriously known to glitch and make you just fly off the edge to your death. It's pretty fucked up. Here we go. Snake man with all my health. But I just take him out with this because Hard Knuckle is very, very slow. And the Mega Buster is very, very versatile. As versatile as you can be dodging an enemy's projectiles. That is... Damn, I jumped too soon. I can use another life. Come over to my place, where you can play Mega Man on my original NES and build a blanket for it. That sounds like a pretty great idea, Taco, but I... It's pretty very... It's very, very, uh... I don't know. Those fish clouds. They were actually like bullets with eyes, Leslie. But thank you for coming. <laughs> and hanging out with us. And this is Snake Man. He's a snake. And a man at the same time, Leslie. What do you think of that? What do you think of Snake Man, Leslie? I bet Leslie likes the uh, snakes that he shoots out. Got him. Leslie says, oh no. Have you ever tried using Shadow Blade against Snake Man before? Yes, I know it does damage to him. I just prefer my good old Mega Buster. It's more versatile, allows for movement. When you use Shadow Blade, you're stuck in one place. So you gotta stick to where you are. Snake Man. Time to defeat Gemini Man. Aw, oh, baby snakes. Tauka says, I still enjoy a well-built blanket fort. Even at my age, I think anyone does. Refer to, uh, the TV show Community for that. Like, oh my gosh. I love that TV show Community. I haven't watched it in a while, but... I love Community. I love the mysteriousness of the music and just the atmosphere of this level. See, that doesn't do shit. You've got to use your Mega Buster. <sighs> I 
yeah, I'll just do it that way. Fuck it. They do, like, no damage. Uh, you can't get it on PSN. Sorry to hear that, Taco. At least you'll be able to experience it by watching it. That, that's worth something, right? Die, giant penguin. Giant mechanical penguin. About to get out Rush Mariner for this. Here we go. Come on, Rush. Get me through this. Ooh, I'm glad that I got some energy there. Only a small amount, but it is what it is. What it is is helpful. That's rough. That's rough to have happen. Well. <sighs> nah. I. I. It, it's not something that can be remedied, really, with talking. It's more of a medical thing, Taco, but thank you. It's not something specific. It's. People who don't have clinical anxiety or depression may not realize it, but anxiety comes to people like us, and depression comes to people like us for no clear reason sometimes. It's not rational. So, I can't really do anything about it. I've tried a very good person who's in my stream right now, um, has been talking with me through the day, helping me through things. I'm not going to go into it or whatever, but that's helped a little bit just to be able to talk, but not, it's not gonna help here, where I'm trying to entertain people, it's better just if I'm one-on-one -on -one with someone. Thanks for the offer, though. Alright, Gemini Man. Gotcha. Thank you, Taco. I appreciate you understanding. Mixel says Mega Man plus, what is that, like a pill? The Napalm Man's weapon because the weapon looks like a pill. Yeah, it kind of does. I always thought it looked like a peanut, honestly. You got Gemini Laser. Alright, let's go. Needle Man. Leslie says, I'm a Gemini. Yeah, that's cool. You ever tried smoking weed? No. I don't do anything. I'm, I just don't. Um, my family is full of drug abusers, so, again, not to go into t too dark territory, there's a reason that I don't do things, and it's because I have family with history of it, and resentment of it, to be very plain, but anyway, that doesn't play into playing games. I take what doctors prescribe me, it helps, for the most part, but things need adjusting sometimes, and that's just the way it's going to be throughout my life. Also, it would have helped if I actually took my medication last night, which I'm going to admit I did not. Um, because I was just feeling sad, and that's paradoxical because you take it when you, you take it because you don't want to feel sad, but it's just, it's, I, I can't explain it, honestly, with 
with it sounding knowledgeable. It, it's not, you know. Damn these porcupines. Those porcupines are so fucking crazy. I think medical is legal in Maryland now. Anyway, Taco, I'm not gonna get into that. That is... that falls under political, and I want damn near zero of that shit in my channel, just because I don't want it to come between me and my viewers. I want to be able to prove that it doesn't matter what we think on the subject. We can all have fun joking about games. That's the reason for my channel. Sex, religion, politics, race. Uh, that's just my thing. Here. Ryan is back. Oh, don't worry about it, Taco. Thank you for helping me in your way. I, I appreciate that. that. That's... I appreciate it. I, I do appreciate you. It doesn't matter what I think on things. I can, already, I can t see that when people are trying to be compassionate, it doesn't matter one way or the other where the politics are coming from. That's kind of the point of this channel. I won't be able to be able to fucking see that you don't need to know about any of that stuff to agree that playing games is fun as shit and we all can unite under that same thing. Um... So I am grateful for you, for you being a Taco Conch, and I appreciate the thought. Um, Rye says, you need dopamine. I think that's what it's called. Substance so to make your brain feel happy. Yeah, they all... It's not just one, it's a bunch of different things. Because you can get a rush of dopamine and still... I mean, like... Kind of like adrenaline rush, like... It's more, it's a little more complex, but dopamine, I don't know. I'm not a scientist, so how the hell am I going to tell you? Alright, we're going for the dock robots now. Return of the Mega Man 2 Master Robots. Hey, Jesse got my headset today. Nice, Elliot. I'm not feeling great. I'm pretty sad, depressed. Can't really explain it. I'm, it's clinical anxiety and depression, so... It's not easy to explain to anyone who doesn't have it. Depression and anxiety for basically no reason is at all is the best way I can explain. I'm playing Mega Man to center myself. I may want to play more Stardew Valley tonight. I don't know though. I can't give you 100% on it. I am playing Mega Man 3 though. And yes, if you think this resembles something else, it is Shadow Man's level, but it's a harder version with two bosses instead of one, and Shadow Man isn't here. It's the Doc Robots, which you'll see soon what those are. Everyone on the Mega Man Maker forum is called, like, a lot of people keep saying they look stupid. I'm like, dude, this was like a fucking terrifying moment in video game history. It was like, no, I thought I had dealt with them. No! It was like, sent chills down my spine. Cause Mega Man 2 was already like, so ingrained into my head. Limbo was definitely not the cause. Alright. Let's see what I can use. No one tell me. Needles, I thought so. Got him. Thank you. 
Ran into it because I'd rather not fall off the edge. There we go. One of these bastards. Thank you. I have three lives. To figure out what weapon works on whoever this is. Every single day, over and over again. That sucks, Elliot. Sorry to hear. Heat Man. I should be able to just take him over with my... I should be able to just take him out with... My Mega Buster. But he is a little different. Take a little while, but... The strategy... Isn't super different, it's just... Timing is a little bit different. Damn it. The lag sometimes from the game itself, like... Makes it so that it doesn't register when I shoot sometimes. Sorry, there's not really much to say. I mean, I'm just doing the same thing over and over again. I have not played any anything of Mega Man 11. The only level I have seen is a little bit of Block Man's, and I'm keeping it that way until I can play the full thing, because... Honestly, I want to experience it like I've experienced every other Mega Man game. Not many other Mega Man games have actually had a demo. Not the core series, at least. I don't think, like, almost any of them did. Unless I'm mistaken, and, you know, somewhere maybe in, like, Japan they did, but... There we go. It's dead. I want to keep it all a surprise from when I play the game. Sparkman. Going back to Sparkman's level. Yep, I mean he already got wrecked. It's the it's the uh dock robots that are gonna get wrecked this time. That's what they're called, it's dock robots. Yeah, I love it. It's very industrious. Metal Man. Nope. Got him. <sighs> Spike fall right afterwards. Here we go. I love the detail they have, like, it wrecked in the background. Like, a lot of this stuff is just, like, 
you can see that he got wrecked, you know? It's the same level, but like, not completely the same. Damn it. Which Doc Robot robot are we looking at now? Quick Man. Shit. He is not one that you like to go up against in any situation. I have three lives. I'm not worried, though. Don't jump on me, you bastard. I think it's Gemini Laser, to be honest. I'll see, though. Mm -hmm. I love the simplicity of these old games. It's nice to see how creative they were, how they were creative with what they had available. Indeed. Indeed. Thing you have up on Quick Man this time is you can actually slide, which helps you get away from things better. It still doesn't help a ginormous amount. <sighs> wow. Alright. Let's go on to Gemini Man's Doc Robot level. I love how these ones shoot blue fire now instead of the red from before. Damn it. Shit. Get wrecked, Taco says. Indeed, thank you. Thank you all for being there. I see I have 10 viewers. I'm kind of just taken aback by that, honestly. In my depressed state, that just kind of blows my mind. I'm like, <laughs> I don't know. Just thank you. That's all I gotta say. It's as simple as that. Thank you. Mixel says, what is Gemini? Oh, what? Oh, hi, Bobby. Hey, how's it going, Luke? Hey, I'm doing fine. I was just coming out to see if Phobia and Digby were up here. Phobia's up here, and oh, Digby's right there, I guess. Hey. Yeah. Because I was gonna close the door All right. and lock it. This is my brother, Data. Yo, what up from the Data stuff? <laughs> I'm in the I'm in the dock robot level of Gemini Man's, so but yeah, Sorry. they're they're safe. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure that. Alright. Thank you. Alright, have a good night. Love you, man. Free life, there we go. Taco says, Luke, I am your father, but he's already downstairs, I'm pretty sure, so. He'll have to forego that, that joke that he's heard 85 million times before in his life. <laughs> uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh man, that sounds like an awesome brother. He's a nice guy. He's an amazing dude. I don't know why he doesn't keep doing his YouTube thing, because he would have more YouTube uh, subscribers than me by now, I can guarantee you. He's 
He's a spicy fella. Looked up to him all my all my uh, childhood. All right. Anyone that cares about phobia is cool in my book. Thank you. Yeah, because he murdered a rabbit. Is that what you're gonna say? All right. Flashman is not that hard. Except the Doc Robot version of him is going to be hard, apparently. Oh. Fuck it, I'm using one. Eight rabbits, Taco says. Eight. See, if I die there, there's no mint point in these stages. I would go back to the very fucking beginning. So that's not fucking happening this time. Here we go again with... The Rush Marine Madness. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. did when I was a kid, for sure, but I never beat them as a kid, and I still haven't beat the NES one, I don't think. I beat Castlevania Rondo of Blood, which is kind of like a version of the first one, but, um, it's in, um, I'm trying to think, it's on the PSP, so I'm gonna try Spark and Shadow Blade first. I don't know why I'm going with Spark first. Oh! Just thought about it, I guess, and probably the right choice. There you go. Should play those next. Yeah. I mean, I've always wanted to beat the third one, because the third one had, has, like, multiple characters in it, too. I really like the thought of that. Alright. Last Doc level. Doc robot levels. Anyway, son, thank you for the uh, compliment, because I am grateful for him. He is a good brother. I don't know if I said thank you, but I want to say thank you. I mean, all the Castlevania games are hard, really. This is the hardest stage in the game, I think. The hardest bosses in the game, too. That's honestly the way I feel. Mm -hmm. 
Oh god, what do I use on fucking... I'll probably die a couple times here, I'm not gonna lie. Airman is not easy. He's unavoidable. He's got unavoidable targets. Nope, that doesn't help. Spark hurts him, but I just died, yep, so, it is what it is, go all the way back. Yeah, totally. It's it's crazy to think how long it, ago it was, you know. Free life. I like it. Fucking airman. friends that are have fa families now too and I want a family but uh you know it's not in everyone's cards right away unfortunately but I don't know maybe they would think of me as fortunate I don't know hard to say This is where you don't want to die anywhere past this, because if you do, you're fucked. You have to grind for for stuff. So you better damn well defeat the next boss. Maybe. Maybe. Try, I don't know. fucking things. Oh, 
I'll just leave that thing there. Holy crap, I have full health. Oh, I know who it is, too. It's fucking Crash Man, isn't it? Holy shit. So, Top Man. Crash Man's my favorite robot master. Here we go. Sparring with my favorite master. Okay. Just gotta remember it. I mean, it's not the exact same. So. Come on. Okay. It did not pause right away. So that scared the shit out of me. He's not exactly the same as he is in the other games. Got him. Uh, in my teens. LOL, 14? Break man. Got him. Oh no, right after we received the last element, Wiley ran off with Gamma. Gamma was a keep peacekeeping robot. That Dr. Wiley is stealing to make a not peacekeeping robot. Alright. We're past the hardest part of the game, honestly. I love the music for this castle, though. I actually can't believe I did this well. Go, go, coming up to here, this sad. This game really does recenter me. fucking screen for a second. I just fucking dropped myself into the spikes. Thank you. 
What the hell? That was weird. That was so fucking weird. I got stuck in the middle for a second. Alright. Shadow Blade, I remember this. Wasps. Shit. That's why I left the energy at the beginning there, because you can get killed. And then have to go through this shit again. of shit. You kinda just gotta fucking ignore them. Holy shit. Oh god, it's the yellow devil. Oh my god, it's the Mega Man 3 yellow devil. What do I use? Hard man's weapon on it, that's right. Here we go. Shit.
I've made a lot of different devils, I know that much for sure. I'm just using another one. I'm not gonna get killed by him this time. Fuck that. Here we go! How many times will Wily remake the Yellow Devil? Yeah, who knows? barriers are back. That's not nice. Come on, what the hell? Why am I not falling? That is so weird. Seriously? Okay. Oh, shit. Okay, it's shooting at me. it off with the screen, nice. I kind of want to go down there, but I kind of don't. I want to see what's up here first, because that, you can't return from that, whatever it is. Okay, it's somewhere you want to go, basically. Thank you for coming. I appreciate it. I hope you're having a great evening, my friend. Copy Mega Man. Who do we use on this guy? Um, Search Snake is what we use. That's right. That was the one, too. Oh, all I need to do is hit him a couple times. Wow, that was easy. You 
usually I have a lot, a uh, lot more trouble with Mega Man 3, but right now I'm actually doing pretty good. It's, it's kind of weird. Why did I go back up? I don't know why that happened. Here we go. The robot lineup. So hard, man. <laughs> Boom. Top man. That was a close one. Shadow Man. Oh, he got me. I don't have any tops either. I wasted most of it on him. Diego says I love... I lost the Fantasy Star stream. I would love to play together with you. That would be fun. Rai says, I guess you can say that he was on the top of his game. Oh my god. Not when I was fighting Shadow Man, though. I wasn't on top of shit when I was fighting Shadow Man. Now I've got to fight him, like, with my... With my Mega Buster like a bastard. It's all gone. Now I've got to. F now I have to fight him with my Mega Buster. Period. I have five lives though, so uh, that's a lot of practice. Taco Conch says BRB. Diogo says haha yeah. Alright. Come on, Shadow Man. Don't be a dick. You know what, Shadow Man? Fuck it and fuck you. I'm done with your shit. I don't give a fuck. Hop all you want, dick. I'll use a second energy tank if I need to. I don't give a shit. I am so fucking done. Great. So, I was trying to press pause, and when your bullets are on the screen, it won't go to the pause menu. So, there goes that energy tank. I mean, this is going to be the hardest fight in the game now. Um, which isn't saying much because it's not too hard of a fight if you are in the right setting, the right mood. Fuck. 
one thing that's tripping me up is fucking not having a weapon for a robot master. Because the fucking top spin doesn't work. Like it fucking should. Get fucking screwed. Piece of shit. Holy crap. And phone, you can get fucking screwed too. I don't know why the alarm always keeps fucking going off at this time of the evening. Anyway, so fuck you. Ah, oh, nice. Now we gotta fight. Fucking... Snake bastard. I didn't even know who, uh, that I was going to him. Fuck! I'm trying to fucking turn, game. Seriously. Don't, don't give a shit using my energy tank. I don't give two fucks. Boom. There's the game, honestly. That's the hardest part. Is if you fuck up and don't have the weapons. Certain bosses. This one is going down the shitter. Do it my way, Riscato, but thank you. Got him. One more. Magnet man. Should be easy peasy. Stupid motherfucker. Um, we are getting this, and we are getting this. Hey Elliot. Fishing in Stardew Valley. Just got the dino egg out of the chest. Wow. That's cool.
Why is it shooting that way when I'm shooting up? God. Fucking analog stick. You're supposed to be able to depend on the D-pad to be precise, but something's fucked up with the D-pad on the controller, so... Yes, of course, it's not Dr. Wiley. It's one of his, you know, duplicate robot selves. Alright. End of boss time. Where's Dr. Wiley? Oh no, it's too late. And they misspelled Wiley, but yeah. Mega Man, you regained consciousness. I found you lying here when I arrived. I wonder who brought you here. This whistle. It must have been Proto Man. question is, do I play Stardew Valley, or do I play Mega Man 4? I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. Is any of my Stardew Valley fam here?
I'm looking for more than just one person. I don't even know if I want to play it, to be honest. Capcom. Yeah, I don't know what to fucking do. I guess I'll fucking... I could start Mega Man 4, but... I don't know what to do. <laughs> I honestly have no fucking idea what I'm doing. Are you here or uh, Leslie? Are you here? Available to play Stardew Valley or do you want to? If you don't want to, then I may just go ahead and do Mega Man 4. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Went into out Mega Man Maker. Yeah, no, thank you. <laughs> If there's two games I'm going to be playing, it's going to be Mega Man 4 or uh, Stardew Valley. But I don't even know if I want to play Stardew Valley. Usually it seems that when Anna shows up, that's that's when I'm like, alright, it's ready to do, well, I'm ready to do some Stardew Valley, but yeah, I don't know. that sleep thing. This is the origin story of Mega Man. Knock me off. favorite song, I think, in Mega Man, any of the games.
It's alright. Gamer Fox, take your time. You don't have to be here if you don't want to. It's not a big deal. Goodbye, Bright Man. <sighs> Goodness. Fair man time. secret items pretty much.
There we go. Holy crap. saying something to break the silence. <sighs> that actually helps me. Means something to me. Thanks for giving me energy for something I just needed to get up here. Very much appreciated. Oh, 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 oh. 
I fucked up this time. Cool. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. You know what, I think I'm just gonna stop. I, I know, I, I'm i depressed, I'm sorry that I'm leaving right away, but... I don't know, I went through Mega Man 3 and part of Mega Man 4, so... I should be glad I at least did something, so... I hope you all have awesome evenings. I may talk with you on Discord if you want to, that's in the description. And all my information is right on the screen right in front of you, so you all take care. Have a good night.